Hey, Nolan, this is Trevor Gross from CUTigers.com here. Um, you had your, your third interception of the season today. Um, Y'all didn't have any interceptions in the first two games, and now all of a sudden you, you have nine in the last four. Um, what, do, what do you think the difference is? Is it just um, a, a confidence level that y'all have now, or do you think the sec secondary is playing more cohesively? What, what do you think the difference is? Uh, yeah, for sure. And then also, you know, the first two games were pretty heavy run teams. You know, uh, Wake Forest, um, you know, they took a lot of just deep shots, a lot of vertical shots, 50, or, you know, 50-50 balls. And, um, you know, I guess we didn't – I don't know if we had any picks that game or not. Um, and then Citadel, obviously, you know, running their triple option. Um, but, yeah, just uh, as of recently, um, you know, guys just doing a good job of being in position, um, playing with good eyes, you know, making plays on the ball. Um, you know, like today it was fun to see. You know, JP came up with a huge pick. Um, you know, it's reward himself for, you know, the hustle to get down there and make a play uh, off that reverse, get a stop, next play, come back, get a pick. You know, that's what it's all about. Um, so it's super cool to see. Before this season, you, you a couple of your interceptions occurred in the end zone, um, but but this season you've you've been, had a, an opportunity to to get some pretty good returns after the after the catch. Uh, how, how how much do you look forward to those opportunities? Yeah, apparently if I would have you know put my foot in the ground, and went left, I would have scored. Uh, <laughs> but you know I, I caught it and uh, momentum was kind of taking me right. My eyes were to the right and that's you know took off that way and got tackled. But you know it would have been nice to you know, put one of those in the end zone, but, um, you know, maybe, maybe next time. No one in the second half, it seemed like the, the defense really just took it upon itself because the, the, the offense obviously was, just had a lot of miscues in, in the first uh, half. Um, did, did you feel that as a unit? Like, okay, it's, it's time for us to um, kind of carry the load and, and uh, get the momentum turned around. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess when, you know, whenever we're on the field, you know, our job is to, uh, to get stopped, you know, create turnovers, create momentum uh, for the offense. And, um, you know, we, you know, today we, um, I, think, I thought we did a good job, you know, playing the balls in the air, um, getting off the field. Um, you know, they, they create a little run game on us early, you know, we're going to have to, you know, fix some of that stuff. Um, but, you know, yeah, it's, it's just great to see guys just coming up and making big plays in the second half. Like Brzee's big – I think it was Brzee's big sack and then Booth scoop and score. I mean, that's, you know, probably the um, biggest play in the game. And then, um, and then you know, JP making a big pick after the drive. Um, you know, it's just, just guys um, – just tough guys we got on the team. But, you know, when we're only up six points, you know, things aren't looking good. And, um, you know, just tough dudes just stepping up and making a play. Um, so I just, I think it says a lot about, you know, this team and this defense that we have. You mentioned uh, Jalen Phillips interception in the end zone. Is, is, is that just like the, the epitome of, of what you, you hope for from a safety? Not only that, but to, you know, the play you made right before to, to save the touchdown by making that tackle. Oh yeah, for sure. I mean, that's, that's what I'd say this program's all about, you know, just guys just giving great effort. And, you know, reverse, bust loose. JP's busting it from the backside, um, makes it all the way down there, 70 yards, makes a tackle on the five-yard line, goes out next play, gets a pick. I mean, I told him, I was like, that's, that's your reward for, you know, that effort going down there and making that, making that tackle. Got rewarded with a pick. And, um, you know, it's just great to see, in a, you know, the young guy to, give, to go out there and, um, and to give effort like that. You know, it's easy to, you know, be on the backside and just kind of, oh crap you know they busted a reverse and just kind of jog down there but you know he takes off um you know makes a great play and then gets rewarded for it you just love to see that and that's just the kind of guy jp is just you know hard worker and um always gives great effort we'll take one more from nolan no this is the second week in a row uh um uh, a long pass for a touchdown on you guys but what are you seeing um, from your perspective on the field from those two plays from last week and this week? I'm sorry, can you repeat that one more time? Yeah, sorry about that. Um, just the long pass plays from last week, week 
Uh, Coach Venable said it was the it was the wrong defense. But what is, what is your perspective on the field from those two plays? Um, yeah, today uh, I think they you know they convert, got a first down, and then you know start going tempo. We get we're in a man call, and they're running smash fades on each side, running deep balls and. Um, you know, that's a tough play for Joe. Um, you know, we, we got to get better in those spots. But, um, you know, that, that offensive dude's on scholarship, too. He's got to make a play. And um, Joe got beat um, on a deep ball. It happens, um, you know, especially when you're playing man to man. But, you know, just, you know, working on technique and um, in your eyes and um, just getting in position to make that make those plays. Um, but, yeah, that's something, um, you know, we always work on. Um, as a back seven, you know, working on, you know, not giving up big plays, obviously, and you know, stopping deep balls and um, just working on your technique and footwork. And, you know, that's something we're going to improve every week. So, um, so yeah, we'll get it fixed. Yeah. Uh